So, Dr. Bray, you said that this product wasn't an inclusive. What does that mean? Oh, good question, Lila. Uh, an occlusive is very heavy, so it actually can form a film on our skin. So, think about a coating on a car. Mm -hmm. It's very thick and it doesn't allow anything to penetrate through or breathe. So there are those types of products out there in cosmetics. These include mineral oils and petroleum jellies such as Vaseline, which act as an occlusive because they're very good at holding on to that moisture, but they're not so good in terms of letting your skin breathe. So our skin, obviously, it's not a coating of a car. Our skin is a living and breathing organism. So what do we want? We want that skin to be able to breathe. We want our natural skin lipid barrier to still function as it was intended. So for example, the mineral rich brown concentrate, as you really greatly pointed out, is not an occlusive, but it's actually an emollient. And an emollient is a product that softens the, the skin and it holds the moisture in, sort of like hydrating the skin, but it doesn't do it to that occlusive level where it doesn't allow anything else to penetrate through. In fact, if you were to add a very small amount of it, as I showed you, put a little pea or pearl size amount, uh, rub it with your fingertips, and then just pat it onto your skin, it actually allows other actives to penetrate through. So you can use your, for example, retinol product, or you can use your favorite moisturizer, or your favorite serum, and you can be sure that these will actually penetrate deeper into your skin after using this product, yielding better and faster results. So I hope that clarified for you. Yes, thank you. <laughs>